You gotta try Dawn Winery's dandelion wine. You're here. Wait, you're... Well, first of all, I contacted more than one person. Secondly, she came here as Jean herself, not as the acting Grandmaster. A Jean you would never see, even as an honorary knight. What a surprise. I heard about the Holy Liar, but I never suspected it was you. So, the sound of the Holy Liar can purify Storm Terror and return it to normal? Is that- That's right! Your honorary knight is putting themselves on the front line to try and resolve this Storm Terror issue. Now that's the hot shot of the Knights of Favonius I'm talking about. Feels like we're breaking the law, though. I understand this kind of absurd explanation is hard to believe. But we can ask the Bard to play the song again to try and persuade... I believe you. To persuade our stubborn command... Wait, what? I can't think of any reason for Devalin's betrayal, given it was once one of the Four Winds. However, if it was poisoned in the battle over Mondstadt all those years ago, and then corrupted by the Abyss Mage after it woke up, we can't really blame it. But as Acting Grandmaster, I obviously cannot make such a statement publicly. Diplomatic pressure from the Fatui makes it hard for us to seek a peaceful resolution to the Storm Terror issue. People would think I've lost grip on the gravity of the situation. That's why I can only do this in private. <sighs> That's one of the reasons I don't like the Knights of Favonius. What surprises me is that you would believe an Outlander so easily. My cautious and meticulous superior, even you trust him, don't you, sir? <sighs> I already told you not to call me sir. Never mind. Uh... <clears throat> This is really awkward. I have a rough idea of where the Holy Liar de Hamel is. Nice recovery. She's really talented at changing the subject. The conflict between Mondstadt and Shneznaya stems from the conflict between the Seven Nations and their respective gods. The Cryo Gods Fatui seem to be after the Animo God's power. Uh... Right. If the Knights of Favonius publicly prevented an attempt on Duvalin's head, then the only other way to affect the Animo God's power is to take the Holy Liar. The number of Fatui that have come to Mondstadt is far from limited. I've already managed to coerce a few reports out of them. Diluc has determined that the Holy Liar is not being held in the Goth Grand Hotel. I imagine they don't want to leave something stolen in a place where it could be so easily found. Paimon gets it. If too much of a scene gets made, then it becomes a big diplomatic issue. <laughs> Such is the diplomacy between the Seven Nations. Outlander, ready to go? Jean just said the Fatui are trying to take Devalin's power for the Cryo God. I fear this might fall short of their true intentions. I think they intend to use Barbados's connection to the wind to draw him out. Just like Lisa traced the source of the storm to the temples. The god of animal? Hasn't been seen for more than a thousand years. What makes you think that's their intention? Oh... Uh... Uh... uh huh? Forget it. I don't like having to pry. Here, take this. What is it? A disguise to protect your identity. Put it on before you run into the Fatui. Unfortunately, they're still one of Mondstadt's allies. At least that's the facade we're maintaining. Our actions are going to get them stirred up. Better to not implicate yourself on a personal level.
There's still a long road ahead. Oh, I'm looking forward to this. defenses have been broken. I thought it was the Abyss Order attacking. How did you guys know the liars here? The place is being kept is locked up tight. If you're after the key, keep going further into the ruins, but don't come after me. I don't know which one of the guards has it, but I'm sure you can find the guards and find out for yourselves. This guy looks like he's about to wet himself. Y you just worry about yourselves. One of the Eleven is already in Mondstadt. Signora, when she gets her hands on you, she's gonna string you up and torture you. When that time comes, don't you dare say a word about me. Did he say Signora? What a strange name. Yeah. Number eight of the Eleven goes by the name Signora. The fact that the Tui can run amok across the Seven Nations like they do is entirely because of the Eleven. We need to act quickly before she gets wind of what's going on. You. How'd you get in here?
Never heard of that association before. What are you lot doing here? That lies way too obvious. You really haven't got anything better. And just how do you plan to borrow it? <laughs> Think you can look down your nose at me, huh? The will of Shneznaya is as solid as the permafrost. I will not yield. Are you here to play with me? There you are, What are you doing here? Did you already beat all the other guards? What? I'm not scared of you. A debt collector will come to my aid. Not like I have a choice anyway. <sighs> All right, you're free to go. But I don't have the key, unfortunately. You'll have to ask the next guard you come across. He says the key isn't here. Shall we try another room? There's one room left that we haven't tried. Surely the key must be in there. you rats scurry out from. Senora's not going to tolerate this kind of interference in our affairs. 
So I'll be the one to take care of you. Save her the trouble of having to deal with you herself. No escape. <laughs> He was here a second ago. Senora is going to end you. The songs bards sing of your demise will be so terrifying. The people of Mondstadt will never sleep again for the nightmares they give them. Big talk for a guy who still ran off in the end. Chicken. <laughs> You want me on your team? As you wish. We meet again, avid adventurer. Are your adventures going smoothly? It is always that way when you are starting out. Preparing properly before an adventure can help things go more smoothly. It seems that you have a wealth of experience under your belt now. Time to introduce you to the formal work of the guild. The guild receives requests from far and wide each day, and assigns commissions to adventurers accordingly. These commissioned adventures are the main source of compensation for our guild members. What kind of commissions are they? It is a mixed bag. Anything from running an errand for fellow citizens to dealing with monsters. Some are textbook, others are extremely dangerous. But you do not have to take my word for it. You should find out for yourself. Here you can find the details of today's commissions. Please report back to me upon completion. There will be a generous reward waiting for you. Patience is a virtue. You will find out soon enough. I'm sure you will not be disappointed. I await your return with great anticipation. Ad Astra Abyssosk. Sorry to bother you again. I am delighted to hear that. In which case, let me try to make this quick. We are most grateful for your commission completion to date. The guild's reputation has grown stronger as a result. However, another consequence is that we are receiving an unprecedented number of requests, more than our current numbers can handle. You want us to do some recruitment for you? Uh, no. Although I appreciate the offer, it would be fantastic to have some new members, but scrambling to officially recruit new members at this stage would not really solve our immediate problems. So what I want to ask is, would your friends have the time to help out? 
No, no, that is not what I meant. I know that your friends come from all walks of life, and asking them to become official members may be impractical. My request is of the more presumptuous kind. A guild needs a favor. Right now, we urgently need to find people for our expeditions. We organize expeditions to explore areas around the city and in the wilderness. It is a way to keep ourselves informed of any emerging dangers, unusual activity in the domains, and so on. Since expeditions are not commissioned by a third party, there are no strict deadlines for completion. However, we neglect them at our peril. If trouble were to foment unchecked, it could easily turn into a major disaster. Pretty important, then. Rest assured that the Guild does not take a cut of the spoils from expeditions. Everything goes to you and your friends. Now, without further ado, let me show you the expeditions that are currently available. You can dispatch someone on an expedition at any time. But of course, whoever you dispatch will be unable to join your party for the duration of the expedition. The duration of an expedition varies depending on the destination. After your friend returns, just come here and confirm the outcome. As your adventure rank increases, more dangerous expeditions will become available to you. After all, with epic power comes epic responsibility! And of course, Matching risk with experience is also for everyone's safety. Thanks again for your help. I hope you and your friends can help out with our expeditions as much as possible. Ad Astra Abyssosk. That welcomes you.
Urine for a little shock.
sure they'd never miss. Closer.
your time.
little closer. <laughs> Closer. <laughs> Did a f the requester even asked me to thank you on their behalf. And, as promised, you are due your reward. Oh, 
Oh, you shouldn't have. Except you totally should. This is a token of the Guild's gratitude. We received many new commissions every day, and without the efforts of each and every adventurer, there is no way we could respond to them all. If you complete enough commissions each day, you will be eligible to claim a special reward from me. Your adventurer handbook keeps a record of how many adventures you complete each day. Make sure you claim your daily rewards on the days that you complete sufficient adventures. You are more than welcome. After all, you are the one helping me. And please note that helping a fellow adventurer to complete a commission also counts towards your eligibility for a daily reward. We encourage you to work actively with your fellow adventurers. Ad Astra Abyssosk. Ad Astra Abyssosk. Today's recommendation... busy recently.
Take your pick.
come from? Recently, I can't decide whether Pyroslime. Tastes better it's with salt and pepper, pepper or recently. garlic. And herbs. There's a strange wanderer near Wolfendom. 